Hey y'all, down at the uh, Pilot Grand Rod Run uh, 2012. And uh, last night, watching traffic go by, this Boss Hog, uh, 2009 Boss Hog uh, trike went by. And usually it's not my thing, you know? But I'm telling you, this one is way, way bad. It's got, I think, a, it's got an LS motor on it. Corvette motor, and uh, I guess that's what the back end's kind of designed to do. And the lights really resemble it. But anyways, let me shut up and uh, we'll take a look at this thing. Look at this thing, man. Is that not crazy or what? It's got beautiful paint on it. I mean, that's like riding like a piano. That's just insanity. Very cool though. Play a gear shift over there. Play your car. Beautiful, like I said, man. Just, just really cool. Nice lines, nice styling. I'm gonna get the dude to tell me some stuff about it. I'll do a little walk around on it here. But wait till you hear this thing. It's like crazy sounding. And tail lights, like I say, it really does look like a Corvette. It's got the uh, it's got a trailer hitch, exhaust. Of course, it's got exhaust, but it's got a V8 in it. Now, like I said, I think it's an LS motor. He said, but again, I'll get uh, I'll get him to tell me some more about it. And even if he doesn't want to be on camera, I'll come back and tell you. I just want to be able to get as much shot right now before a big crowd gathers around. Is that just not crazy, man? Like I said, I usually don't like these strikes, strikes with the two wheels in the back and the one on the front, but I think that one's way cool. Anyways, let me run this dude down. We'll take a closer look at it. I'll get you some information on it. John, how are you, brother? Good. Tell me a little bit about this thing. I was, I mean, I'm overwhelmed by it. I did a little clip where we did a walk around and all, and I couldn't tell people much about it. It's got, does it have an LS3 motor on it, you said? Yeah. And still fuel injected and all that kind fuel of stuff. Injected. Did they do any kind of work on it? Uh, with several modifications to the engine. Um, originally started off with probably about 460 horsepower. Now I'm up to about 580 horsepower. Holy cow. So uh, custom exhaust all the way back, headers. The whole nine yards. Now you say custom, isn't this thing full blown custom to begin with? Oh yeah. Yeah, and so then you wanted even more custom than that. Yeah, it's, it's above and beyond. Wow, dude. How long have you had it? Uh, since 09. You bought a brand new? Cool, man. How do you like driving it? I love it. Yeah. It handles great. It's perfect. Power steering, reverse, all those kind of things? Well, the power steering, no, not so much, but it does have reverse, automatic, or three speeds, slap shift. Oh, really? Have you run it to drive strip or anything? Yeah. What kind of times do you get there? Uh, on the 8th, I get uh, low fives. How fast is that? I'm all the way up to probably about 120 before. Ooh, <laughs> wow. Good move. Man, it handles and hooks up and all that? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm on the back two wheels the whole way down. So oh, really? If I put wheelie bars on it, I'd probably get a better time. But right, right. I don't so you just can't turn it loose like that? No. Oh no. Not around. Not around. What's the fastest you ever had it? I mean when you was down in Mexico. We know you didn't break the speed limit here in the States. But that time you took it to Mexico, what's the fastest you had it? About 155. Wow. On the interstate. Yeah. In Mexico. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah, that's right. In Mexico, of course. And it was still handling well? Yeah. No kidding. Handles like a car. No kidding. <laughs> it's not a top heavy or like a throwing but no? Wow. And do you pick out the colors and everything? Dude, awesome job. Like I said, I, I saw you last. 
I saw you last night cruise down, and I was like, man, I hope that dude stays and stops by. Yeah. yeah, and this is like a trunk back here. All right, anything else you want to tell me about it? Just say you would recommend somebody get one, they still make them? Oh, yeah, they still yeah. make them. Uh, you can actually go to their website, bosshoss.com, yeah. and you'll find more information on it. But, uh, yeah, they're, they're great, and it's made, actually made in Tennessee here. So. Oh, no kidding. Where at? Uh, I think it's around on the other side of Franklin, uh, around Nashville. There okay. Other, so. I always like helping people out from Tennessee. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. John, I appreciate it, brother. Yeah. Thanks so much, man. No problem. Thank you. Folks, there you go. 2009 Boss Hog, LS3 motor, 500 horse. How crazy is that, man? The Grand 2012. Hope y'all have enjoyed it. See ya. See you, brother.